I'm Amanda Bertoncini, celebrity host and correspondent for Millennium Magazine, and I am so privileged to be here at Charles David for their Market Week, and also we're getting a sneak peek of their Fall 2017 presentation, which we've been told are the first ones to get their hands on. So I'm going to introduce you to Dana, who is the designer of Charles by Charles David. Nice to meet you, Dana. It's amazing to meet with you. This is so fun. Thank you so much for being such a good sport and for helping us with the most beautiful shoes in the world. I'm going to leave with a bunch. Now, I want to get started with your top five trends that you've been seeing for fall 2017. I see you're starting with one shoe in particular. So please let me know why this is so special, the materials that it's made of, and your inspiration for this shoe. So now I think with fall 2016, we know how important velvet is. And what's fun about fall 2017 is we're getting much more emotional. You know, we're going up the leg. It's really ballet inspired. It's so much fun on a hundred millimeter, comfortable, wearable. You're wearing this with a dress, but now we're getting more casual with velvet. We're definitely going with the jeans. Maybe you're wearing this ripped, a little bit more edgier. We're having a little fun with the up the leg. We're just having fun, basically, with velvet, wrapping it around. This is definitely a fun shoe, and um, velvet is seen everywhere, in clothing, uh, chokers, everything, so you can all match perfectly. Definitely. Now, what shoe do you have here? This looks straight out of Carrie Bradshaw's <laughs> closet in Sex and the City. Yeah, so forest green is such an important color. You know, we're getting a little bit more military-inspired this season. But what's really fun about this is it's satin. And now we're seeing satin in different ways. It's not the traditional dress, you know, you're going to a wedding type of look. You're wearing this now with your slouchy jogger pants or even ripped jeans. And it's, you know, with that loose knot that people are liking because it's like very clean looking but still edgy. And we just love it that it's still at your ankle. This is early fall, you know, here in New York. October still comfortable weather to walk around in these. Oh, yes, definitely. And it's amazing that you can wear that shoe with a jogger. That is very hard to do, people. <laughs> so um, they make it work. Now, this one I like to call my princess shoe. Please tell me everything about it. <laughs> so still with the satin look, embroidery is so important. Here, you know, it's the fringe. It's the sequence. It's a little bit mesh, so it's very sexy. This is our number one seller, the Max. It's 100 millimeter, the pointy toe pump. It's a staple in everyone's closet. You know, it never goes out of style, but you do need to update it time and time again with a new material each season. So this is our favorite right now. I'm obsessed with it because, yes, you can wear it with your boyfriend, Jean, your leggings. And also, I was talking about it with you, a bridal reception, a bridal shower. It is so um, unique and beautiful. Mm -hmm. So oh, what do we got here? So back to the whole military inspired type of item, you know, we're pinning up old British type of police look with the elastic. It's very comfortable. It has that deep V for a little bit of a sexy peep toe look. And now updating with this beautiful mauve color, which is now our new nude in a way for fall. Yeah, it's like nice. It's another reason to buy that blush tone. It's flattering on every skin tone. It's just an amazing show. Nude was definitely the trend of the season. Everything was nude. Everyone was nude. Now, mauve is definitely a great take on it because it does have a little bit of pop, and you can wear other things with it that, that match, just yeah. like nude. So I'm happy about that. Now, here's nude. This is nude again. This is, I mean, nude will always be the thing, but... Now what we're doing is we're really experimenting with this nice stretch material. You know, there's no oh, wow. zipper. It's just like a sock, oh, my you God. know? I, I and it's very sneaker inspired. You know, you want to be sexy and have that casual look. I mean, it's still very dressy, but there's something about that it just fits you like a sock. And it's like a sexy look. You know, you're going out, you're going to meat packing, you're doing whatever you want to do in this shoe and no one's asking any questions. See, I really didn't realize from the structure of it, because it looks very structured, that it would actually be mm -hmm. so sock-like and comfortable. Mm -hmm. And that would be perfect for the meatpacking industry, because we all know there's cobblestone. <laughs> 
now. Yeah, this is attitude, all right? We have fur. We know how important fur is now. And, you know, we're used to it inside your shaft of the shoe, and, you know, you're nice and cozy. But now we have attitude. We're bossy. We want to wear it up high on a blocky heel. We want to wear it in your face. It's just a lot of fun. This is the UGG for the boss, yeah. the inner boss in you. Mm-hmm. Oh, this is my favorite. This is what I'm taking home tonight. Yeah. <laughs> so tell me about fun. this. Yeah, this is a lot of fun. We have um, our second skin, all suede, upper, comfortable heel, chunky. It's wearable. You walk all day in the city in this. Have the lace up the back for that, you know, extra bossy look that you want to have over the knee. You know, it's an everyday type of boot. You wear it day into night. And that is what the aspect of this is because we don't want to carry so many shoes with us in our bags if we have to drive or we have to walk to work we want one shoe that's our staple so we don't have to carry two extra bags just for our extra shoes to walk in now this this is i'm going to end it with bossiness attitude in your face we're going lace up the back lace up the front we don't know what's happening but we just know this girl's a boss and we want to know who she is. Yeah. <laughs> I imagine her, you know, just wearing something skin tight, body calm, but you could really wear anything with this. You know, you have attitude. You want to walk and show off. It's just a great over the knee, lace up type of look, you know? Now, that actually brings me to my next question. When you are designing these beautiful, beautiful shoes, do you think of the woman first? Where do you get your inspiration mm-hmm. from? Do you imagine who the woman would be wearing them? I definitely imagine each girl. You know, everyone has their own thing. And we also go through different moments, you know, when we want to be casual, when we want to be dressy, what type of attitude we're feeling, how we're doing during the day. Definitely get inspired by people here in the city. I always am looking. I'm that girl in the street that's watching you, you know, looking at what you're wearing, what type of shoes you're doing, what you're, where you're going is so important. Yeah, I get inspired by all the different cities, all the different types of girls, you know, and from, you know, wearing sneakers to going out at night. What stores can we find these shoes in? So for Charles by Charles David, we're located in a lot of big name department stores, Nordstrom, Macy's, DSW, anywhere, basically. Zappos.com, Shoe Buy, everywhere. Now, also, how affordable are these shoes so everyone can know? Oh, okay. So it's between 89 to 199 um, depending on the type of shoe and the material. That's it's very approachable. Yeah. It's great. Wow. Thank you so much, Dana, for bringing life <laughs> to my being. I am obsessed with your line, and you have been great. Thank you so much. It's been great. Thank you for having us. This is wonderful. Thank you guys. Signing off. You can see more at millenniummagazine.com and it's also featured in print. So get ready.